international Indian scientist Mayan Swami Annadurai. He was popularly known as Moon Man of India. He was born in Quantico, Tamil Nadu. He served as a director of ISRO Satellite Center for 36 years. He contributed two major missions on Chandrayaan and Mangalyaan. India first the mission to Mars, the Mars Orbiter Mission or Mangalyaan completed its 300 days journey because of him. He received Butler Street, one of the highest Indian civilian award in India in 2016. Pulmonary circulation is responsible for another portion, portion of 
carrying that to uh, responsible for carrying the blood to the rear sinus, then away from the heart and then to the lungs and then to use for oxygenation. So to yet systematic circulation. Systematic circulation is another portion of uh, responsible for circulating blood to the heart. To the heart, to the every organs and organs and tissues in the body, and deoxygenate blood back to the heart. Sir, heart is a primary organ of circulatory system. It needs it comes back to the comes back to the brain. Good morning for all of you. My name is Sanjay Ram of 9D. I am here to explain my project. My project is Human Skeletal System. The Human Skeletal System will protect our body from the injuries. The Human Skeletal System will protect our internal organs like heart and lungs. The longest bone will be present in our body is femur. That will be present in our legs. Next, the shortest bone will be present in our ears. Next, Next, I tell some parts about now I tell some parts in our human skeletal system. First one skull. Skull will protect our brain. Next, rib cage. Rib cage will protect our organs like internal organs. Next, ilum. Ilum where the ilum where very very function function of the body. Thank you. Good morning. I am Anna of class 9C. Here to explain about DNA. This is DNA. DNA means deoxyribonucleic acid. DNA is the molecule that that carries in, that carries the genetic information for a development of human body. DNA is made up of two link strands which wind around each other uh, to resemble a, a twisted ladder, a shape known as double helix. Thank you. Good morning, everyone. I am Asan from Class 9C. Today I am going to explain how transpiration takes place. Transpiration is nothing but the plant will release the water vapor through the stem or leaves. Let's see how it happens. The plant root will absorb the water while we are watering or raining. Then afterwards, while the sunny time, while the sunny time, the root will release the water through the stem, then through the leaves. Uh, there is a small microscopic pores in the leaves called stomata. Stomata is surrounded by the god cell. God cell will help in regulation of the transpiration. Based on this topic, there is a Tamil poet, Padivadar, Maramadar, Padivadar. Good morning everyone, I am D. Mohamed Ajman Taksin of class 9C as I here to explain about the lungs. The process of inhale and exhale of air is respiration. The organ of the respiration is tight via horn, gas and lungs. The lungs are too spongy elastic bags. The left lung is slightly smaller than the right lung. Inhalation. The process of taking of air into the lungs is inhalation. Exhalation. The process of expelling the air from the lungs is expiration. 